What's up, what's up? GS350 JP in the house right now with DJ. And we were in uh, Sukiya eats a ticket talking about, uh, you know, the same old thing. Women in, you know, Japan making money and stuff like that. So anyway, homeboy was telling me about uh, uh, his friend in um, China. You want to tell the story? I'll let you tell the story. Okay, I'll so anyway, he, uh, he was talking about, you know, his friend in China where... <laughs> I was trying to start up schools and stuff like that, and talking about business. But he said, uh, what I said about um, the word nigga, right? In Korea, it means you, or, you know, and in China, they use it too. And it means that one, or this one, or something like that. But it, remember, it just refers to something like that. Anyway, and the word my, they use this word my, and it means by. So out there, he said his friend would go to the store and he hit these little kids talking about, my nigga, my nigga, my nigga, my nigga. And what it means, it means I want to buy this or I want to buy that. So he says he's walking around China, he's laughing and stuff, right? So he asked his girlfriend, you know, um, what does nigga mean? And she said this one or that one or something like that. And then he said, what does my mean? So she said, buy. So he said, well, what does my, no, she said, he asked her what? How do you say yeah, yeah, my? Yeah. How do you say I want to buy something yeah, or something yeah, like that? And she said, "My nigga, my <laughs> nigga." <laughs> That's cool, but I swear, you know, because that word "nigga," I'm, I'm just saying, you know, because I'm thinking, you know, maybe because of the wars and stuff, brothers go overseas and stuff, and hitting up, you know, with the women and talking to them. And if over in um, Asia, if they use a nigga, means like you or that one, like in Japan, it's like, oh my, you in front of me and stuff like that, you know. Um, maybe that's where that word nigga come from. They probably actually did not come from the word, the N-I-G-G-E-R word, you know. And it's just really interesting because you go over there and I mean, you hear kids, everybody talking about my nigga, my nigga, my nigga, my nigga. It is maybe because of the exit. So you know how, you know, we walk it down the street. You see somebody like, "What's up, my nigga? My nigga?" You know what I'm saying? I forget, you know, but yeah, I still remember. Like, damn, my nigga. You know, like, like when uh, they do something good. You know, like win a basketball game or whatever. You go, give me five, my nigga. What's up? You know, so all that time, you know, we saying my nigga. You know, maybe it's saying like, want to buy this and I want to buy that, but I'm, I, you know, I really want to. Um, check up and see where actually if it was transported from China or Korea by other brothers and stuff because um, if the word does relate to um, if it does mean you in some form or matter then of course you know because you know how um, how uh, sometimes people picking up different languages and stuff and using it and they just come back overseas and just saying nigga this nigga that nigga this you know and uh, I mean, because, you know, we, I mean, you can get mad at the video or whatever, but if you go over to China, I know China, you know, the N-I-G-G, uh, N-I-G-G-E-R word, I mean, the nigga, the way they use it over there, the spelling, whatever, it didn't come from N-I-G-G-E-R, you know, and I'm sure uh, white people didn't, uh, I shouldn't say white people, the racist people they didn't derive it for us, you know, um, you know, cut it short or whatever. So I'm actually thinking that word was actually brought over here by other brothers who have been overseas in wars and stuff like that or whatever, and they just used it because uh, when you do go to other countries, you will pick up, you're going to pick up the language, you know, you got to speak the language. It's not like, you know, that. So it's, it's really interesting, you know, you know, so if anybody out there can do some research on it, do that because... That would be cool too, because then, if uh, like I said, we can um, actually find the history of that word, you know, and see how it got over here in the United States and how we're using it, then um, we can actually uh, use it. We can get rid of the bad meanings of it, you know what I'm saying? Because in the states, you know, we saying we oh we just say nigga because. It, it because of the word it has something to do with the N I D G E R word, but in fact it probably don't have anything to do with it. But we're just thinking it does, you know. And actually, no one hasn't done it. Um, the uh, what is it called? The uh, where am I going? Uh, the uh, history on it, you know. So it's cool, but yeah, I'm gonna have to go to China, man. 
Because I would sure love to have any of y'all brothers out there in China make some videos of people buying something saying, My nigga! Yeah, that means I want to buy this, or I want to buy that. My nigga! My nigga! My nigga! My nigga! Walk up. Just imagine, man, you a China, you walk in a Louis Vuitton <laughs> shop with your girl, and you know, and she doesn't really speak too much Chinese. I mean, not Chinese, but American, um, English. And she just like want to buy everything. She goes, my nigga, 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 my nigga. And you like pumping out all that cash and shit, you know. And you're probably thinking like, because she pointing at something, you know, you know she won it. She's just saying, my nigga. You're like, damn, man, my girl cool because, you know, she talk like black people and stuff. <laughs> you know, because she, we went to the store and she pointed at something and said, my nigga. You know, and, you know, I can't get mad, you know, for her calling me a nigga because, uh, <laughs> You know, she like hip hop. You should see the way she dressed. You know, and it's cool. You know what I'm saying? Cause she loved me, and I, you know, and I don't think she's, you know, she, you know, she doesn't mean anything bad about it. Because you know, in America, sometimes you know, your close white friends call you nigga too. You know, so my girl, she was in the store all the time calling my nigga, my nigga, my nigga, and I was like, damn, man, she loved me. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, and then the next thing you know, you get on, the, you start studying Japanese, and you kind of find out all that time she's saying my nigga. She was saying, buy me this, and buy me that, and buy me this, and buy me that, or I'm going to buy this, or whatever, you know. So, it's a trip, though, but, yeah, some of you uh, brothers, if I can, do some little history on that. I'm going to have to do that, too, on myself, because uh, maybe that word was transported over here, and uh, the brothers that brought it over here actually probably didn't, know if they did, somewhere in the mix, somebody probably forgot, because I said this in one of my other videos. So that's cool, man, because you go around and just spread the word. Because they be like, my nigga. Damn, man, that's, what What movie was that in that they used that word? I can't think of the name of that movie. I know I heard it in some movies. God. Rush Hour? Rush Hour? Remember? Rush Hour 1, Jackie Chan. He got, he got in that fight at the pool table. They were playing pool. Uh -huh. One of them was like, my nigga. And then the. Uh, Jackie Chan copied him, I think. Oh. Maybe it was Alan, I think. Okay, could be. Yeah. I don't know, but even Jackie Chan, he know what my nigga means. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he know who it is, dude. And that's called, I wonder if he even told anybody in Chinese that that's what my nigga mean. Because they over there, they over, I'm, I'm telling you, man, they over in China and Korea, you know what I mean? It's just their nigga, nigga. I mean, it's not their nigga, nigga. I mean, it's they, they, uh, their uh, language, you know, nigga is there. So that'd be cool, man. Be able to walk over there and go, yo, nigga. But then if you say nigga, 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 over there, I guess you say my nigga. You walk up to a friend and go, my nigga. And then the Chinese people run up and go, no, 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 you can't buy people in China. <laughs> no, no, no. But it's cool, though. But yeah, that's that's good, man. I mean, you know, let it out the box. Let it know that, hey, you know, that nigga word came from China. It just mean you or that one over there or that one. Because, you know, um, we always say that one. Who did it? Police, you know, walk up. Which one did it? That one. You know? And that one does refer to people. Right? Mm -hmm. Which one did it? That one. This one. Was it this one? Yeah. yeah it was that one right there. That nigga right there. <laughs> <laughs> My nigga! <laughs> so anyway, I just thought I'd let y'all know. But y'all, uh, it's all fun. You know what I said? But, you know, if the word nigga did come from over there, and if it's nothing derogatory... You know what I'm saying? And, you know, we can cut out a lot of this stuff. You know what I'm saying? And then we can start calling everybody. Walk up to the police and go, my nigga! You know what I'm saying? And they get all said and take you to jail and stuff. But you whip out a dictionary and say, hey, I'm speaking Korean. I'm speaking Chinese. Well, it's, it's, well, we, you know, it's just the way we interpret it. I'm like, well, you know, just because you are, uh, 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 you, I forget what that word is. Cause you don't, uh, there's a term, I forgot my educated term for that to use. Just because you culturally, culturally ignorant or something, or whatever. Anyway, I'm out, peace.